hello guys welcome back to the channel so let's continue our project so as you know that we created this player controller and also imported those two packages but before running this application we need to add another package so add dependency and in here we need to say permission handler so wait a second permission handler this is the package name you want to add so just press enter and it will be downloaded and after that you need to run your application okay so here is our application running and in this controller first of all we need to create a variable so it will be final and we can say audio query and it will be equal to our new own audio query okay so okay we can remove that new keyword and after that we need to check for the permission so i will use own init here and in here i will just pass a method which will be check permission and now we need to create this so it will be check permission which will be an async method and in here we need to create a variable so var permission is equal to await permission dot storage dot request so it will just send a permission request for storage and after that we need to check so if the permission dot status code or we can use granted so if the permission is granted we need to say let's return our audio query dot query songs and in here we need to pass some parameters so the ignore case will be true and wait a second and after that for the order type it will be order type ascending or smaller and for the sort type it will be null and for the uri type it will be uri dot external just save it okay so this is the condition when the permission is granted else we need to send a request again we need to pass this method so that it will just run again and again till the user has not granted the permission save it and now we need to go to home and in here first of all we need to create a controller here so let's say var controller is equal to get dot put and in here we need to pass our player controller save it and the application is stopped so why the application is stopped let's see okay so the application was unable to own audio query which was not loaded okay and after that git unoptimized okay so let's just run this application again before that in this main we need to change the material app to get material app okay so after that we can run this and this is our player controller and everything is good okay let's run this application again okay so now our application is running let's close this and in here let's just copy everything from the body from padding to the padding and cut it and now we need to use a future builder here and we need a future of list type and the type of the list will be of song model so this is the model we get from the audio query we have not created this and in the future we need to use our controller dot access storage no sorry there is a mistake here if the permission is granted no problem let's just keep it empty and if the permission is denied run this application means run this method again and in the home property we need this controller dot audio query sorry it was a mistake and in here we need to pass query song and we need to pass those values here so the will be true order type will be smaller and the sort type will be null and after that the uri type will be external and after that we need to remove this async snapshot from here and in here we need to check for some conditions so the snapshot dot data is equal to null so if the data is null 
we need to return a center widget with a child of let's say circular progress indicator and else if the snapshot the data as the data is list we can check that is empty so if the data is empty and now we need to pass a null check here so we need to return a text widget and in here we need to say no song found and uh, for the style we can use our our style here and now we need to wrap this inside a center widget and for the else condition let's return our body here save it and now we need to remove this extra return from here save it and you can see that no song So the list is empty here. Let's close this application and rerun it. Okay, so I guess we need to remove this. Okay, let's remove this condition from here. Save it. And here let's try to print our snapshot our data here. Save it. And it is still empty. I guess we cannot get the music from our emulator. So I need to run this application on my real device. Let's get that permission. Let's get that condition back and close this. And now I will run this application on my real device. Okay, so the application is running on the real device and you can see that there is no issue here. Okay, so if I just print it, my snapshot, snapshot dot data here and save it. Okay, so we can see that we get everything. Okay, so now we can just remove this. And in here for the music name, I will just change this to the actual music. So it will be snapshot dot data. And for the index, I will just use our song name, this display name without extension. Save it. And now we need to use a null check here. Save it. Okay, so here is the music name. I cannot show you because there are some contact numbers written on these. And after that, for the artist name, I will just use the artist of the song snapshot dot data dot according to the index. 